you amazing beautiful people and welcome back to another What A K Rock aka One O'Clock Reaction video and today we are checking out the live orchestral version of I Was King. This has been a very recommended, very requested song from all of you for me to check out so today I think it's about time I finally heard what all the fuss was about with this one. As with all of the reactions on this channel, this is literally picked from all of you. If you have a recommendation, make sure you leave it in the comment section down below. How I decide what songs to listen to next is I literally read the comments on my old videos and I see what you've all recommended. So let me know in the comment section what you would like me to react to next. Also, if you want to join me for any live reactions or recommend any new music or new artists, the best place to do so is Twitch. Link to my Twitch channel is in the description. Click that link, give me a follow over on Twitch and you can recommend stuff live straight to my face. Anyway, enough of my talking. Oh man, I'm so excited to hear this one. Let's jump straight into my first time ever reaction to Why Don't Care Rock, I Was King. far as intros go this is a this is a uh, this is an intense one this is an intense one also sometimes these reactions have to be blurred if for any reason this is a blurred reaction the full unblurred reactions are always uploaded to patreon link is in the description i do my best to not have to have them blurred but copyright sometimes works against me Rewind, I've got to rewind. Did you see the fucking violins, man? Did you see the violins? I wish, I hope one day that you can just react to songs the whole way through and not have to worry about them getting taken down or, or blocked or anything like that because man, I just, when you love a band as much as I love One Okay Rock, for me, for you guys, you've all heard these songs before. For me, this is literally my first time ever hearing this song ever. I listen to nothing outside of YouTube. I keep it all genuine. I keep it all honest for you guys. I, I, like So I don't binge watch or listen to anything outside of YouTube, which sucks, but... It makes the reactions that much more pure. And I know there's so many channels out there that don't do that, that regularly listen to music or will listen to the songs before and I say they don't. And I never want to be that. So for me, when I'm sitting here, I'm listening to this, I just want to listen to the whole thing. I don't want to pause it, but I have to. And man, oh, this song, I know I'm going to cry like a baby at this one. I can already feel it, those lyrics, I can feel it.
before, but the guy on the right, the guy on the right um, in One OK Rock, the guitarist, he looks a lot like Jonathan from Stranger Things, right? Anyone else see that? reason I fell in love with this band is for their lyrics and I don't know what it is about them but fuck me they just hit like a bus they just hit like a bus Damn it, man! Come on! I might have cried at What a K Rock more than any other damn group on this channel when you compare how many videos I've checked out. Because some, I know, like, with some of the bigger groups I've, like, on this channel that I've reacted to over the course of time that I've been doing this, I've reacted to more songs. But statistically speaking, I'm pretty sure it's over 50%. <laughs> like, with What a K Rock. Ah! Oh, fuck me. What an awesome song. I love it. I love the lyrics. I, the orchestra just added this whole other level of emotion to this song as well. To the performance of this song. The crowd participation. Singing along as well. Attacker was getting them going and getting them to sing the outro. And Oh man. God. It just hit different. Just hit different. It's so rare to get this kind of emotion portrayed in rock music. It's really hard to do. It's it's a bit easier in pop music because obviously there's more of an emphasis on vocals. Um, but in rock music, it's harder because the whole point in rock music is half instrumentals, half vocals, and having a voice that works with those instrumentals. So to convey emotion, it's more difficult. I, I in my opinion, and I'm, I, the, uh, One OK Rock have nailed it. They've nailed it. They've perfected it. They, it. It's so rare. I use the comparison to Linkin Park so much because it's in, personally, it's my only experience with this kind of music with a, with another rock band I used to love and um, and how they managed to somehow con convey emotion. Like it, you felt it, and obviously with all the stuff that happened near the end with Chester Bennington, you understand why there was so much raw emotion and passion in their music. You understood it then. It all made sense. <clears throat> With Tacker and with 1OK Rock, it's, it's the same. I feel it. You know, they feel like they're leading the charge in the change of this world f from the frontier of rock music. That definitely, you know, they feel like with, with some band you listen to, you feel like they're a voice for you. You know, a generation of people who just shout into the void and no one cares what you have to say. You know, political leaders don't care. The government doesn't care. Some, some of your friends don't care. Your parents might not care. And you're just shouting into nothingness. You know, asking for change, pleading for it, you know, seeing the light, but no one wants to walk towards it. And then you have bands like this that just make you feel like they're there with you. They're holding your hand. They're guiding you. They're part of, of this journey that you're on. And they're a voice for you. They've got a louder shout. They've got a stronger shout that people will listen to. And when you can't speak, 
they speak. I fucking love them. I love them. I really do. I love every song I've heard. I love their music. I love their sound. I love their message. I love them. I love them. They are an absolutely incredible rock band. And every single song just hits so hard. It hits hard in the sense that it's a fantastic song. I Was King. Brilliant song. Very well done. Absolutely loved it. And it hits hard because there's so much emotion that goes into the construction of this song as well. And you can see that in the lyrics. It's so good. The orchestra just made this so epic. So epic. Just took it to a whole other range. Oh. (laughs) I can't wait to just continue down this rabbit hole. I want to hear everything they've done. They're such an awesome band. I really do love them. I really do. They're just so awesome. So awesome. I hope you guys are enjoying these reactions and these videos. I really do. I'm really enjoying making them. I'm really enjoying exploring more about from this band. I love them so much. The fact that as well they like they've like support they commented on my videos and, and retweeted me on Twitter and, and stuff like that. It's crazy. I'm like a nobody. I'm a nobody. I'm just a random guy in his attic and they did that. I just love them. I love them. Oh man, as with all my videos, make sure you let me know what song you'd like me to check out next by this band or any other band, a band that you love that I haven't reacted to yet. Let me know in the comment section down below. A band or a group that you think I need to hear and I haven't yet, put it in the comment section down below. I try and read every comment on my videos. Even if I don't reply to them all, I try and read them all. I hope you have an absolutely wonderful day wherever you are in the world. Like I said as well, if you want to join me on Twitch and recommend stuff over there, it's the best place to do stuff. You can do it to me directly. Link is in the description. I hope wherever you are in the world, you have the most amazing day. I really do. I love all of you incredible people. And as always, my friends, you will see me in the next video.